The green economy is a rapidly growing sector with many exciting and rewarding career paths to explore. As a result of an increase in public awareness of current environmental issues, coupled with the introduction of Ontario's Green Energy and Economy Act, there's been a broad cultural shift that has seen many industries adopting green and clean business practices. Ultimately, this is resulting in a demand for employees who have the skills and desire to succeed within this diverse and exciting sector. We're an ethanol plant located in Elmer. Um, this plant was built, opened in 2008, and uh, we have been, been producing um, in excess of the 140 U.S. gallons per year, and it's shipped out of here on a daily basis. We look for individuals who have the ability to learn more. When we seek employees, we're looking for individuals who have their grade 12, we need individuals, or I, I would say prefer individuals who have pursued some post-secondary education, and that can be at a college level or within trade schools. We look at candidates who have math, sciences, chemistry. Um, that allows a good base for them to apply for positions and have an understanding of the chemical process. Uh, we have taken individuals and developed them further. For example, an individual who was in our shipping and receiving, they were hired in a contract position and it was for a short duration. However, we had an opportunity to open up as a health and safety coordinator. And we had made a decision when the position became vacant that we could possibly develop an individual. So someone who had the skills and understanding of how the plant operated and we decided we would give that individual the skills to be our next health and safety coordinator. So we had an agreement he would go back to school. Uh, we sent him to seminars maybe a couple each month and he is becoming a specialist in health and safety and he's able to support our health and safety program which is so important to our success. Working in a chemical plant we need to make sure that everyone comes to work and goes home as safely as they arrived. When discussing career opportunities within the green economy, we're talking about jobs that will exist within a number of different industries, such as construction, that will require green collar workers that have an increased focus on building green, or the manufacturing industry, which will be creating a new demand for managers, engineers, laborers, operators, and material handlers who are all green specialists. The transportation, utilities and waste management industries will all require green experts that will assist with developing and implementing more efficient and environmentally friendly processes when dealing with pollution, waste management and carbon emissions. These are just a few of the career opportunities that will exist in the rapidly growing green economy. The part I like most of my job is that I get to see so much of the detail and the workings of the plant and the new technologies that it involves. It's a never-ending learning process. I have the opportunity to work with our shareholders, uh, the banks, the uh, local government officials, uh, the community here in Elmer. What an opportunity, and we're quite excited about what we'll be doing next, as well as maintaining this and growing it however we can. This series of videos was produced by the Four County Labor Market Planning Board the Sarnia Lambton Workforce Development Board, the Elgin Middlesex Oxford Workforce Planning and Development Board, and the Workforce Planning Board of Grand Erie, which are all members of Workforce Planning Ontario. In partnership with the Passport to Prosperity Program and the School College Work Initiative, the School College Work Initiative Grand River Region is a cooperative effort between several planning partners to help students in their transition from secondary school to college. The SCWI provides a wide range of learning and awareness opportunities for students, teachers, parents, and the community by describing pathways to college and apprenticeship programs for students, increasing parent, 
student and educator awareness about college and apprenticeship options, and implementing new program options for secondary students, such as school within a college and apprenticeship level one. The Workforce Planning Board of Grand Erie serves the communities of Brand, Haldeman, and Norfolk, and helps them plan for their future workforce.